Hey everybody, I got a special video for you today. We're gonna do Chunga with a no backing challenge. So basically the challenge is that Chunga, you can see her kit here. Um, I guess you can't really see it. I thought I would show all the abilities at once. <laughs> but her passive is Jade Rabbit, which lets you buy items um, from anywhere on the map. So we're just gonna go Sands of Time with Book of Thoth and to cool down. And we're just never going to recall. And if I die, then I mean, I suppose that's when I can buy items and stuff too. But I mean, I don't want to. That's not really what I want. We're going to go meditation because it's more important with this challenge. So now that I've left base, no, no buying items. Or no, or excuse me. I could buy items, but only with my rabbit. And here's the Changa kit. I'm so sorry. There's, I've been, a lot of viewers have been saying I should open the ability menu for all my videos. Uh, since though they're just learning smite or whatever, but uh, I, I forget to do that sometimes. But yeah, Junga's Junga's a cool god. Are they suitors in frogs clothing? So yeah, I'm gonna go Sands of Time, Book of Thoth, Chromos Pennant most likely. We're also gonna kill those hives, cause if I kill these, he's kind of in a weird spot. Sands of Time gives me more mana the lower health I am, which is awesome too. Okay, he just placed another hive, which I will kill, because I'm not letting you have that benefit at all. Oh, I'm taking huge amount of damage. Huge amount of damage. All right, he don't miss. Oh, never mind, he does miss. Probably gonna use another potion and then get Chalice. Which Chalice doesn't make sense because I'm not gonna be going back to base very often, so it's not gonna refill. But I'm getting it because I get three potions at once with one rabbit trip. So it's kind of nice in that way. Maybe it's a bad idea though, because it's not really gold efficient. Okay, I should not be going for that. Also, he's got blue stones and not mannequins, thank you. Bluestone's good on AMC, but it's not as annoying as mannequins. Okay, I still have my mana potion, but with Sands of Time, we don't really need it too much. Just gonna try to do some poke to him. Maybe try to get him to recall. And what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna pop... Uh, I think I'm gonna pop Meditation just so that I can get this blue buff. Uh, I really hope I can take this. Probably should have gone for my own, because if I don't take this, uh, then that's going to be really bad. Hey, okay, he is coming back now. All right, we do get it. Nice. Let's get tier two Book of Thoth. Book of Thoth. I think it's Thoth. It's so funny to me with so many so, some items and the ways they're pronounced. Like with like that item, it was always Book of Thoth. Like everybody called it Book of Thoth until Thoth came out. <laughs> and then people were like started looking into it and they're like, "No, it's actually Book of Book of Thoth cuz it's Thoth." And he has like three different names and that he goes by. A lot of Egyptian gods have different names they go by. It's always funny to look into things like that. Same thing with kin size. The I think I believe the correct way to pronounce it is chin size, but uh, people got mad at me for that. Even though I pulled it up and I was like, "No, this is the way you pronounce it." Uh, I eventually did a poll on my stream. And it was voted that I should say kin size. So I have to say kin size from now on. Wait, don't recall, don't recall. What are we doing? This is a no recall challenge. Just use that heal. We got infinite sustain. Oh, I, I was about to throw the, throw that. I got to ult just to get some pressure. Cause I'm kind of getting owned a little bit. All right, let's start putting points in the three. I need, I need some healing. I'm, a, I'm, I'm about to die. <laughs> All right, we need to buy potions too. Come on, rabbit. Why are, are you shopping so long for? 
All right, he's out of mana, though. One cool thing about this matchup, actually, I can show this, is Chunga's 2 gives you mana back when you take damage from an enemy god. So if he uses his honey, let me wait for it. It's not very efficient until late game, until you max the ability, but... Let's see, if he uses the honey with the bees... Which I don't think he's going to do. Okay, well, next time he does it, I'll, I'll try to point it out. But if you look at my mana bar, it'll go up like quite a bit against Amazenkov. Because it's every tick of damage, it gives mana back. Like right now, it's only 20 mana. It's also one reason nobody levels this ability up. But what's cool is it actually restores mana to allies too. So I have it on instant cast. But if you do quick cast, uh, this area... If you use Chunga 2 in like AMC Beast, it'll restore mana to all allies in that area. Whoops, I kind of just walked into him on accident. Okay, I thought he was going to all. I'm super scared. Buy me a potion, please. Yeah, I'm starting to regret the chalice a little bit. <laughs> just a little bit. Oh, I tried to use my two. I'm dead. Okay. Actually, hmm. I'm wonder. I'm wondering to make this like a truly no recall slash only buy items with the rabbit. I'm not gonna buy items in base. That's actually what I'm gonna do. I'll, I'll wait until I get back to lane and then I'll buy items, or at least like blue buff. I think it'll be more interesting that way. So I'm going. Actually, we're gonna go breastplate, not Chronos pennant. I don't know how much more interesting it'll be, but that way the rabbit is actually pretty much buying every single item I have. I didn't start the game like that, but I don't know. We'll do it now. Oh, I tried killing that hive. Unlucky. Well, when I die, I get my, <laughs> my potions back. Why does my ult not go off? There we go. That was super weird. That was super weird. Yeah, you see, I got I got 80 mana back from doing that. Most of the time, it's not worth it until later on when you're getting more mana than the ability cost back. But right now, that is not the case. All right, let's go on Hive Patrol. All these hives are giving him quite a bit of benefit. Also, my heals kind of sucks right now. Kind of garbage. I need to be using my two more. Uh, the way I've been using it is just not good. At, at this point, we have a ton of mana, though, so I can just spam my abilities as much as I want. I don't have to worry about it, which is kind of amazing. I would say this challenge is pretty common. A lot of people do it because it just works with Chunga's passive. Like on any other god, you can't really do this because you need items. You absolutely need items. Let's see, walk back to base, I guess. <laughs> he's going what item are you going i'm probably going to want divine ruin my three has anti-heal on it like 50 percent but divine ruin just because he went soul eater second relic i'll hold on to that second relic super important to hold on to okay i kind of want to kill that hive because he uses he loses a lot of benefit if that dies. Also, I know it's better to use the Chunga three into the one because it's faster to do that. But the one has more range, so when he's out of range of my three, it's better to just initiate with the one and the three. But um, yeah, it really depends. Oh, he went kin size. I'm not even going warlocks. I was thinking about it, like maybe, but now I'm not. I'm definitely not going warlocks. Um, let's go this. Go buy my item.
I also think this is the guy that's easiest to play with high ping. My ping's... To me, 120 ping is very low. Um, but if you're ever lagging, I recommend picking this guy. <laughs> there we go. Look at that. Okay, okay. Oh, this is still down. Did I see that on the minimap? I definitely did, right? That it was still down. Feels so weird not backing. It's like, okay, but I'm supposed to back. Oh, we got horrific, which means... Uh, do I have my rabbit right now? I think I do. I need you to get me this. I need to heal. Thank goodness he doesn't have anti-heal yet. That would make this awful. He's getting anti-heal though. He's working on it. Yeah, I get horrific against Chunga too. It's a good counter. Uh, like when I'm playing Ymir, I'll basically force Chunga's two. And then I will use, uh, use horrific and she's just dead. But if I have sprint, I don't have to worry about that. Uh, barely out of range. Let's get Divine Ruin now. This isn't really even a challenge. I'm never running out of mana. <laughs> this used to be more of a challenge before Sands of Time, but honestly, with Sands of Time and Book of Thoth, I just don't run out of mana right now. Honestly, at this point, I'm just going to start doing damage like this. Slowly but surely, I will take that tower. I promise you. And my MP5 is 62, so I'm getting an ability every 5 seconds. Pretty much. I'm wondering if I can meditation bait him. Probably not. All right, next item. Next item, item, item. Honestly, Rod of Selfies could be kind of hype for increased healing because he's getting anti-heal. And specifically because all of my stain is me staying in lane. Oh, he's not even close to me. Whoops. Could have taken that red buff, by the way. Kind of my bad. Oh, I'm not in the range of that, buddy. <laughs> Unlucky. Sometimes it do be like that AMC. It really do. I want to save my two for when he ults. But I don't know if I'll have the reaction time. I'm use Mentation here. Nope. Didn't have the reaction time because I'm trash. Now, this is where it's a little bit difficult. I cannot recall here. So. I spam abilities. That shouldn't hit me. Oh, you got your ult again. I forgot about that. Silly AMC mechanics. Oh, you get that? Bro. Okay, okay. I can't get that because the bees are kind of covering the path to go get it. Yeah, Rod of Selfies is mostly just going to let me heal a little bit more out of combat because, again, in Smite, there's a thing called Brawling. And if you're not fighting an enemy god, you have 30% anti-heal on you. So Rod of Selfies will kind of help me with that. Because otherwise I'll just never be able to get to full health. 
Ooh, this is bad. I do not want to be here. Save my two for the slow. You got wards. I need to get wards too. Let's get a sentry. Because I know where the wards are. Oh, he's going for it. He's going for it. Oh, he canceled though. I wasn't expecting that. I need to kill that hive. Otherwise, there's no way I get away. Rip. It's all good. It's all good. Yeah, I saw the honey and the hives on the demon king so i was like i better go for it and he was waiting to the side uh it used to be that you could actually see like demon king from kind of far away but now you have to be really close to see it he's also getting zero defense i'm only one level down which is not even bad Okay, I got the minions out of Phoenix range, which means there's no backdoor protections. And now he's fighting without a hive. Or actually, he does have a hive somewhere. I think. Very important to keep the minions out of my Phoenix range. And get this item now. I have 30% cooldown. I, I'll have full cooldown late game. I should be overcapped. So I'm not going to worry about that. Uh, would like some more power. At this point, he doesn't even have Brawlers. I, he got Crusher instead. I'll let him take that buff. Don't want to fight for it right now. Right now, I'm on the defense because my Demon King. Let's get a... Uh... Oh, I'm not sure. Doom Orb could be cool. I'm not gonna lie. Lots of power. Don't really need pen since he's not going defense. There we go. Although, getting Route of 2D, even if he doesn't have defense, would be kind of awesome. Because he's already at half health after I use like one ability or two abilities. Unfortunately, he cleared the wave, so I don't... I can maybe get his tower off that, and that's about it. And buffs and stuff. Uh, yeah, let's go Rod. Polynomicon could be cool, too. Poly's great against gods who don't build defense. Killing those hives is super important. Okay, okay. Dang. How much do I heal for? Quite a bit. Wish I healed for a little bit more. fighting without oh no he still has a hive behind that wall that i just didn't know about i'm healing for two wait 329 i think i saw without his hives he's pretty much dead yeah yeah killing those killing those hives are so important if he put that one over the wall, he would have got so much movement speed and attack speed. And it just would have been kind of hard to finish him off. He is getting defense now. Um, so I'm glad I went Rod of 2D, which has pen. Let's heal our minions here so that they let fight longer. Do get Phoenix here. Nice. And I'm back to full health of mana. 
Let's go. Why would you ever recall on Chunga, actually, though? Forget about the challenge. Now I just need to upgrade my starter item, pretty much. He's kind of in a weird spot. Don't know if I can kill him here, but I'm gonna try. Nah, he's too fast with the hives. I'll just do some hive cleanups here. Go get red buff. Can almost afford pendulum. Alternative time I would be hilarious, by the way. It would be really hilarious, because I'm kinda it's kinda hard for him to kill me. But I think that with the build I have pendulum of ages is a must. Plus, gives me more MP5 if I ever somehow get low mana, which I don't think will happen. Got 240 mana from that. <laughs> okay. Let's buy this. Is Pestilence, he has Heartseeker, he has Kinsize. I don't know why he has Heartseeker and Kinsize. I don't, I do not have that much HP. Ooh, I do take a lot of damage though. Do take a bit of damage. 550 heal. <laughs> Damn. I, he, he needs more anti heal. I won't lie. Is a hive behind this wall. Don't want to alt yet. I want him to get to the point of no return before I alt. There we go. Because if I ulted him earlier, then he probably would have been like, oh no, I'm going to lose. And then he would have just ran away. But because I waited, he didn't realize he was within kill range. And that is no backing, Chunga. I, I I go on autopilot when I play Smite a lot, so I really hope I didn't recall. I might have. I, I Sometimes I do stupid stuff like that. If that happened, I'm sorry, but uh, pretty sure I didn't recall once. I died, but that's about it. Uh, but I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And again, all the videos for this week up until the 18th are pre-recorded. Um, I'm recording them all on October 11th, but yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you want me to play a god, just comment it below, and when I get back uh to recording some more videos i will i'll be looking through those so anyways uh, i'll see you guys next time have a good one oh and here are the game stats always forget to show those